Tonight, we continue digging deeper into Cumberland County's plan to open additional remote learning centers. As we've reported, Cumberland County schools will remain closed until at least January. Six libraries will open next week for children of county employees. The county says the program is needed in order to maintain essential county services. CBS 17's Kayla Strayer spoke with Des. More centers will be opening for kids in rural areas. Everyone's essential. Cumberland County mom Michelle Hallis wants schools to safely reopen and doesn't agree with the plan to open up learning centers only for specific students. We are basically taking a public building and making a private school and funding it by the public. And that's what's not right. We can't pick and choose who we are going to allow to get educated. Michelle says she thinks commissioners are doing the best they can considering the Board of Education chose to keep schools closed for now, but she wishes the two groups would develop a plan that benefits all 50,000 students. They should have worked together. County managers say they'll be sending out a request for proposals to nonprofits and community groups so they can apply for federal COVID relief money to open additional virtual learning centers for the public. Commissioner Charles Evans says for now the additional centers will only be for families in rural areas of the county to help them with internet connectivity and transportation issues. Just like how you guys helped out the county employees, what can be done for these people who don't necessarily live in rural areas, but they're still struggling? Well, in some instances, this will help those individuals. The county says more details will be released after their meeting this Thursday. I think it's a great thing for our community. When could these potentially open? Hopefully real soon. I believe that they will be open long enough to do what they're supposed to do. Reporting in Cumberland County, Kayla Strayer, CBS 17 News. Now, the schools are providing staff to help with learning centers at libraries, but for now, they say they don't plan to have staff at the additional learning centers.